Welcome back to Sonic Adventure Episode 8. We're gonna go to the next stage, which is a place called Red Mountain. Turns out Sonic's just colorblind. It's kind of brown, really. <sighs> a stage with a cutscene to start us off. We're chasing after the egg carrier to go after Amy and finish his part of the game, really. Oh, really? Is we close to the end of Sonic? Mm. Not really. We've still got a while to go. Oh, okay. Right now, let's focus on what's going on here with the... <laughs> uh, okay, okay. I was just okay. about to make a comment saying there was a lot more death in this one. There is. Just in this stage alone. Don't you love getting stun-locked into oblivion? Oh, yeah. Just my favorite part of any game. Ah, yes. All right. Let's uh, keep things moving, then. <laughs> Who set this up? I don't know. This, this is a bit more uh, chaotically designed level, really. I'll say. It's got a really good soundtrack, though. It does, and that's about the only thing going for it. Aw, oh, you don't like this stage? Not my, not my favorite. I mean, I'm, I'm not, like, raging at it or anything. It's just really dumb in some places. Okay. It's, it's just not my favorite. Well, you can't have award winners every single time. Oh, no. I mean, one's got to be the weakest link. Right, and uh, we were talking last time about... Oh, God. Oh, wow. That's mean. That was lucky. That asshole monkey's laughing at me, too. <laughs> he will get his comeuppance one of these oh, days. But, uh, we were talking last time about Sonic Generations and how the, uh, you know, the city is... Not city escape. Oh, my gosh. We just did S this one. Speed Highway? Speed Highway was the one from Sonic Adventure 1. Why wasn't it a different level from this game? I mean, you have a lot of good contenders, but why that one? Yeah, you can only pick one, and I guess they went with the one that fit thematically with everything else, I guess. Okay. Of course, it it does make doesn't it, it does not make a lot of sense when you think about it because you have Speed Highway in one section and City Escape in the other. That that's what I was kind of getting at. It's one thing after another, and they almost seemed like the same level. Yeah. I don't know. They could have picked some better courses. Everybody knows that. So Sonic Team! Maybe if they made Generations 2 and actually stuck with an idea for once, we'd have something. <laughs> right. But they wouldn't do that, would they? Right. Ideally here, we're supposed to use the Ancient Light to take these guys out. But you can see a lot of fucking good that does. Uh-huh. So you could have just as easily homing attacked them one after another and it would have worked. Yeah, in fact, it would have worked a lot better. Wow. So even back in the good old Sonic days, mechanics don't work properly. Not always. Not always. You, you really are just better just, home, just homing attacking because you have more control on what you're doing instead of just letting it all fly away with an unruly auto-targeting system. God, this is a bombastic song. I love it. It's, it's great. It's going nuts. It's the only thing that it has going for it, like I said. <laughs> I mean, at least there are some interesting uh, platforming sections, you know. Mm -hmm. We haven't seen that before. Oh, no! <laughs> I've, been thinking we should, I've been thinking we should ever do uh, the Wii Sonic games. Oh, just as long as you play them, because as you know, I can't play them. Not very well, no. No, terrible at him, because I hate I him so much. I don't know why that hammer is not activating the rocket. You'd think it would. Yeah, I know. Maybe it's activated by uh, hedgehog feet. I don't know. Maybe it's uh, scans for biological material? I mean, when Eggman put this all together, I'm, I'm assuming he put this together because who in their right mind would make all these robots and all these mechanics right here? He's probably going, Sonic will never figure out how to do a uh, hedgehog-activated platform. No, but he can figure out to go into the second part of the level. Wow, we're only halfway done. Now okay. we're inside the volcano. It's looking a lot more red now, I'd say. I would say so. The soundtrack, not doing so good. I like the song, actually. It, get, it gets better. Okay. So this is like the volcano stage in Sonic 06. Pretty much. 
they really did try to recreate Sonic Adventure. But it's just infinitely better because you don't have to stop every so often and take out some enemies. Don't have to rely on Knuckles to light lamps. Yeah, nobody Yeah, nobody has to do any of that. Nobody's getting stuck in anything. Well, yet. Why didn't they just do that? Why didn't they just remake HDified, not like the extra one we got on the virtual consoles and all that, but why didn't they just redo the entire thing? Well, I guess they tried to do that. They just need some better level design. They had absolutely shit level design in the later Sonic games. This keeps flow, it's more of a platformer, yet it's got some speed to it. There's a challenge to it, I feel like I'm in control on certain aspects. Oh, one ring. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, yeah, that was a random ring box. It can give you one, five, t uh, 20, or 40. <laughs> you got the short end of the stick on that one. That's not fair. Yeah, it happens. All right, time for a shortcut. I Ready? This. I see it. Go. Ooh. That was weird. Whoa, okay. You almost did not make that. I did not, no. Branching paths, I like it. Tons of rings for you. Plenty of rings. The rings never stop. Probably because you you're getting hit so much. You can't collect just a hundred and stop there. Gotta have all the rings. Alright, this is, uh. Yeah, that was, uh, bad for me. <laughs> Who's putting hammers in this volcano? Uh. <sighs> This is the home stretch, really. This level's almost done, too, can you, if you can believe that. Jeez. In fact, it is done. Wow, you were right there. Yes! Dun, 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 dun. Was that any good, Sonic? All right, yeah, thanks. Not bad. I appreciate that. He's so courteous I, to I you. I really appreciate that. That's very nice of him. Thank well, you, we Sonic. caught up to the egg carrier, but now it's getting away again. How are we gonna go get it? I wanna fly high. Oh you my called gosh, it. I'm a genius. Hey, I'm a genius. <laughs> I was gonna come look for you, but you know what? He's he's self-sustainable. He can take care of himself. Okay, there is no way. What? Okay, now there is a way. Sonic was at a tilt. There's no way he's staying on that thing. He's grabbing onto the back. Finn. He's he's holding on. Okay. Didn't look like it from that angle, so Don't question. Maybe I'm silly. He's on the plane. Alright, alright. Don't question Sonic games. So now we are essentially just doing the sky chase thing again, but it's redone! New Game Plus? It, it, yeah, actually. I don't think I'm ready for this in my Sonic games. There are more enemies, and they are harder, and we got a special surprise at the end. <sighs> don't tell me we have to shoot Amy down. <laughs> hmm, that'd be a dark twist. There's just an enemy plane with Amy roped to the bottom side of it, and is like, Go ahead, Sonic! <laughs> I knew you wouldn't be able to discern your girlfriend from another plane! He's just, he just locks onto it and doesn't even care. <laughs> Don't even think about it. Just one of the things we shot down could have been Amy. No! Or it could have been all those birds we've been saving for some reason. Of course, uh... Eggman's more evil in the, uh, vain kind of sense. It's like, I want to destroy the world and erect a statue in my honor. Not the, I, c I want to stomp on puppies and see their mothers cry. True, he just wants to own everything. Yeah, so I don't think he'd do something that sinister. <laughs> in my fanfiction, he does. <laughs> well, that's my head cannon. <laughs> my OTP is Eggman and Bin Laden. You know somebody's written that. I'm sure. Not, not just yours, but also mine, where Eggman is like this diabolical character that kills people. Transforming time, by the way. Does this mean we get to go faster? 
Uh, it means that we transformed. No, oh, okay. I would say without a purpose, but there is a small purpose. Uh, it slices through ships now. It's to get us and keep us on the egg carrier. What? <laughs> you'll see. It, it's like attachable legs or something like that? Oh, you'll see. It's supposed to get us up there and keep us on there. I mean, I was about to call this game silly, but, uh... Oh, yeah, th this is where you call it silly? <laughs> right no. right here. This part right here. No, not until we uh, reach Big the Cat. Yeah, that's gonna be, uh... <laughs> ah! Okay. Mm. Were you trying to go into the afterburners on purpose? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> I would laugh if you actually took damage. It's just like, whoa! That would teach kids a lesson. Don't go into the afterburners. Of course not. Well, that might take sales from Sega's other series, Afterburner. Oh, yeah. Oh. Kids, don't buy Afterburner. Because they haven't touched that franchise in 23 years. Have you always had that machine gun? Yes. It's not very accurate, and it's better to lock on. Oh. Okay. Now it works when you're facing the egg carrier itself. Whoa. Oh, my gosh. Boss time. That's right. Now that we know what to expect, we're ready to take him head on. So it's basically just going to shoot a bunch of missiles at you, right? Yeah, oh! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it hurts a little bit, too. What? That didn't take him down? What is that blade made of? Teflon. There's <laughs> so nothing too major here. It's not that hard, really. Just open up. Open your big stupid mouth, and there we go. Dead. <laughs> wow. You know, that actually does look like a face. <laughs> it's just Wait. screaming in pain. Oh. Uncle Andros! <laughs> Eggman just comes up with just a face and two hands. <laughs> Starts yelling about James McLeod. <laughs> <laughs> Who's that, Tails? <laughs> oh my gosh, Tails is a member of Star Fox. We gotta land on the All right, here we go. Whoops. Uh, I forgot something. What's that? There's no landing gear in this mode. What? There's no uh, landing gear in the transformed uh, tornado. Okay. So now, so now we're stuck here. Okay. Astute observation. Okay. That propeller should be gone. Those wings should be gone. He knows how to make a crash landing pretty well. Yeah? So now we're at the third hub world, the Agaria. We'll be exploring this next time on Let's Play Sonic Adventure.